Motown was influenced. You know, he he ran his uh, Barry Gordy ran Motown very similar to the assembly line. You know how Ford did. He had his artists. You know, he would take an artist that somebody singing sitting at the front desk and put him on a song. But the process from that to there was artist development. I mean, he really he literally created artist development. I feel like that's one of the things that got me to where I was. You know, when I signed my record deal with Kanye, I was nowhere near ready. You know, he saw the potential in me and he nurtured it and developed it. And I feel like Barry Gordy, you know, people talk about the businessman Barry Gordy was, but it really takes vision and, you know, he was an artist. To have that kind of vision, to have that kind of execution, to have that kind of uh, just awareness spiritually, man, that's like, uh, that's an artist that cannot be duplicated. What I can say is that it's an honor to be somebody from Detroit, and I'm just glad I understand the importance of it. You know, I'm glad that, you know, maybe I was put in this position for a reason. You know, maybe, you know, as I get older, I, I want to be a better musician, a better songwriter, a better, you know, every better man, just in general. And I feel like a lot of that is, you know, me looking at the great men and artists that Detroit has, has uh, produced. You know, Detroit raises champions, man. So I'm just saying, like, let's pay respect to them. <laughs>